What's up YouTube, it's your boy Mike here from People's Choice Gaming and today I got a breakdown for you of the best max damage builds for a 3 formid Synapse in Damage 2.0. Sorry I got this video out, you know, a little bit late since Damage 2.0. There's been so many new weapons that it took a while to get all those done too. But I'm now mainly working on all the older weapons and popular weapons again. All the weapons you guys been waiting for. So I got a little footage here before I get into the breakdown of how to best mod the synapse on some infested and then grenier. I got a little bit of quick infested just to show you how it only takes a tap at like level 50 or 70 or whatever it was. It only takes like a millisecond tap. And then even at level 140, it only takes a couple seconds. Like two, two and a half seconds to kill an H at a level 140. Or like one second for a charger just so powerful and then on my grenier I'm killing them in about you know a millisecond once again at level 50 and at level 100 which is right here you know I'm killing them in about a second or two napalm guys about three seconds because they are crazy tough the, they have a ridiculous amount of armor and do so much damage there's a napalm guy there way more than any other grenier in the game but yeah I'm busting out 21,000 560 damage a second on this bad boy against Grenier. 43,000 damage on headshots. Do you guys want to be able to do that damage? And do the best damage you can with the synapse? Well, this is how you do it. Alright guys, let's go ahead and jump into the best damage builds for all three factions on your three forma synapse. You're going to want to do exactly what's in the build. This has been worked out, and this is for the top damage you can possibly do with the three form of build. And just to let you know on my Infested and Grenier, if you have enough fusion cores, you got two points left and one more point, and you can take Heavy Caliber all the way up on both of those factions. So do that if you can. I'll have mine up all the way, hopefully by 5 4 mode. I just didn't have, I don't have quite enough yet that I want to spend, so. Starting with Corpus. You're going to want Heavy Caliber all the way to the top in the V polarity. Vital Sense all the way to the top. Split Chamber all the way to the top. Serration all the way up. Point Strike, three ranks. And Cryo and Stormbringer all the way up. Your point strike only needs uh, three ranks for 100% crit chance. You want serration, split chamber, and heavy caliber all in the V polarity. You're going to add three Vs with the three formas. Your cryo and stormbringer is going to be magnetic. It's going to do 75% bonus against shields, 50% bonus against robotic. And yes, I understand it's got electronic base damage, or elect electric I mean, the uh, synapse. And you could just add ice to get magnetic or poison to get corrosive and then put another mod on but this is the best damage and um, with this full build here you will do 21,560 damage a second or 43,000 damage 43,120 damage a second on a headshot now on Grenier all you're gonna change is your, mag your magnetic combo to a corrosive combo doing 75% bonus against armor and 25% or 50% bonus against robotic and once again same damage 21,560 or 43,120 against headshots for infested you change it to blast which is full crowd and a full hellfire doing 25% bonus against infested and um, you will do 13,200 damage a second or 26,400 damage on headshots a second. And little fun fact, no matter um, 3 form or 4, 5 form or whatever, your synapse is going to do roughly 3 times the damage of your flux rifle. So yes, surprisingly, synapse crushes the flux rifle. You want to use it. And before I go, last thing I want to fill you guys in on. Some people you'll see that have made some videos, you know, for fun, or you know, they're they're helping you out, showing you builds. You'll notice some people they get they get confused and they just put on cry or they just put on poison because that will make the combo you want, and they don't put in stormbringer, and then they'll add an extra um, they'll add the an extra mod like 
hammer shot instead of Stormbringer? Well, let me tell you that if you add hammer shot instead of Stormbringer, you're going to do 3,000, well, you're going to do 2,940 damage to be exact, less. So yes, hammer shot is a good amount of damage for the mod, but it is not the best damage. And why would you want to do almost 3,000 damage less, or 6,000 damage less on headshots? Especially when that's a lot of damage for a higher level survival, that means a lot. So most people, you know, you can't be mad, they just don't know how to work the math out for builds. They just put on what a good mod is, they don't know how to do the math. So just to let you know, do not use hammer shot. This is for max damage, right what you're looking at now. Grenier, same thing. Uh, or Infested, same thing. And for Grenier, or actually, sorry, for um, Infested and Corpus, since you have enough points to take Heavy Caliber up all the way, even if you put Hammer Shot in and Heavy Caliber up all the way, you would still do a thousand less damage than Stormbringer. So, just to let you guys know, <laughs> do not put Hammer Shot in. Alright, that's everything, guys. It took me a while to do the math for everything, to level everything and edit and everything, you know. So please smash that like button, comment, like, and subscribe. I'll catch you guys at 5 p.m. Standard Eastern Time for the live stream with my homeboy Megamu. And yeah, I'll catch you guys later. I hope you all enjoyed. Peace.